It started online and ended with shots fired. A shooting in a parking lot leaves three people injured. Police in Melvindale sent scrambling after an argument on Instagram really spiraled out of control. And this happened Sunday night outside of the ice arena in Melvindale, and cameras captured the chaos as it occurred. Rod Maloney live with that story and more on what police are telling us, Rod. Well, Devin, police are telling us it was a 16-year-old that they are looking for who was actually shooting indiscriminately into a crowd. Now they have a partial look at him, and here it is. Take a closer look at the young man here wearing the white jersey with blue and red stripes, blue jeans, and black hooded mask. Melvindale Police Chief Dan Jones believes you can see just enough of his face to tell who he is. One of three young men wanted as persons of interest in this shooting. And while you can't hear what's going on, TCD News Dearborn posted several Instagram videos showing young men chaotically shoving and pushing each other. This starting after social media chatter brought two large groups of teens looking to fight with each other to an Allen Park school and as the intensity grew moved over to the Melvindale Civic Center Fieldhouse ice rink parking lot. The video shows just how the gunfire went everywhere including into cars but hit three young men severely injuring them. Chief Jones saying all three were 18 years old from Melvindale had various abdomen chest and buttocks gunshot wounds requiring police to apply tourniquets and other medical assistance before EMS crews could arrive on the scene and then take them to Beaumont and Detroit receiving hospitals. They remain in critical but stable condition. After police broke up the melee, Michigan State Police helped detectives process that crime scene. And let's take one more look at that person of interest. Melvindale Police describe him as a short, skinny 16 or 17 year old. Again, he wore his white jersey with blue and red accents, blue jeans, and a black mask. Now that video shows you this was a very chaotic situation and Melvindale police are saying that they still need help getting to the bottom of all of this. If you have any information whatsoever, they want to hear, for, hear from you and they ask you to please call them. Back to you. Well, in fact, Rod, police are looking for two other men. What do we know about them? Mm -hmm. Well, you know, interesting, you saw that picture of the young man that we were able to show you. Apparently, the other two men in that picture may be the suspects or pre persons of interest. They asked us to blur the faces. And so, like I said, they're still looking for more information in this. And uh, so, if you again, if you know anything, please call Melvindale PD. Absolutely. All right.